this video, I made more than 200 million coins in 5 hours in Hypixel Skyblock. Here's how. Money making methods have always been one of the most searched terms in Hypixel Skyblock, even more than how to plug in a USB the right way the first time. If you're a mining sweat, such as myself, you know that we have it good. We have access to probably the best money making method in the game, which is gemstone mining. The best mayor for mining is going to be Cole. He gives multiple perks that benefit would be miners, but the only perk we care about is Mining Fiesta, which basically doubles the profits from mining in any public island. You might have already guessed that Mayor Cole was in office when I got 200 million coins. Well, you'd be wrong it was Mayor Jerry, which is basically the same because every six hours he would steal a different mayor's perks and you've guessed it, he steals the mining fiesta. Before we go on to the rest of the video, I want to remind everyone to please subscribe and hit the thumbs up button. It's free, like you don't even have to pay for it, so why not? I really want to hit that 30k for a YouTube rank, baby. Now let's get started because I've already not participated in the last mining fiesta because of some stupid real life job. But today, I'm gonna try and participate in the last mining fiesta that Mayor Jerry will provide. Obviously, I'm gonna be gemstone mining, but which one will I do? There are currently three ways to gemstone mine. Armadillo mining, ruby mining, and jade mining. Since armadillo mining is cringe as hell and jade mining makes me stupider by the hour, I decided to go with ruby mining. Luckily for me, I have my own private ruby route that I can just chill in. So I'm gonna go dig the route in a little bit before the mining fiesta so I can start the fiesta with my route already dug out. Hopefully. Since I found myself with a bit of time in my hands before the mining fiesta starts, I wanted to ask you guys if you remember this game called Amnesia The Dark Descent. This game used to be the rage for up and coming let's players back in the days due to the insane reactions people would have playing the game. I decided to play it recently and wanted to give some of my initial impressions. Amnesia The Dark Descent. This survival horror game is a masterclass in suspense, fear and keeping players up all night with a combination of jump scares and an eerie atmosphere. Picture this, right? You're stuck in a castle in the 19th century with no memory of how you got there and creatures lurking in the shadows. It's like a nightmare except you can't wake up. Players must navigate the castle, solve puzzles, and try not to pee their pants while avoiding the various creatures that call the castle home. The graphics and sound design are top notch, creating an immersive world that feels like it's alive. The game's mechanics are intuitive and well designed, making it a smooth and engaging experience that should sure leave a lasting impression. On your underwear, that is. So in conclusion, I think this game is a must play for fans in the horror genre. Personally, I think this game started a new genre in horror where you just run and you can, literally can't fight back. And if you're looking for a good excuse to sleep with the lights on, I know that I sound like I'm shilling for this game, but some of the greats needed to be remembered. So play this game. Alright, so I just want to preface this video and say that I've been awake for 10 hours already. So I'm probably not going to try as hard as I can doing this. Like, I'm so tired that I feel like I just sat through 10 hours of Naruto fillers. Or maybe like an episode of Boruto. So I'm probably going to go straight to bed as soon as I finish the mining fiesta. I'm basically saying that I'm sandbagging and that if you were to try hard in a kid's game, like the cringe boy that you are, you could probably have better rates than me. Alright, mining fiesta has begun. Still haven't finished digging out my route, but it's partly done, so I'm just gonna finish this up and get started. Alright, finally done. It took longer than expected, but you've never heard that one before. Now if you're not rolling on the floor laughing or roffling as the kids say, then you're probably a loser. Or 8 years old, I don't know. But let's get started. If you're wondering what my gear is, I basically have maxed out everything, my tree is for gemstone mining, maxed out fortune and almost maxed out mining speed. I have maxed out Devon's armor and a Devon's drill with one missing silex. I'm using a bow pet with quick claw for security and cuteness and because it gives me a bunch of mining stats but no one really cares about that. Alright, I'm in the middle of gemstone mining now. So far so good. No issues of note have popped up and I hope that it stays smooth safe from here on out. I don't think it's gonna last long though since I already feel a bit tired right now and I don't think I'll be able to operate at proper conditions throughout this whole event. One massive downside that I absolutely hate when gemstone mining is when your mining sacks get full. It's such a tedious process that is in no way fun at all. It's like playing cookie clicker but it's made for losers who don't want to have fun 
ever. It's like wanting to play a claw machine game, but instead of coin tokens, you have to insert 50 pennies each time you want to play. They should definitely fix this or add something that circumvents this whole process of compressing your sex. There's got to be a better way, man. Folks, it's been two hours of pure madness and I'm still standing, barely. I'm running on fumes and resorting to some pretty hilarious measures to stay awake. I've taken so many trips to the bathroom that I'm starting to think that the faucet probably has a crush on me. And let's just say that washing your face with cold water is like getting a slap in the face from mother nature. Wakes you up alright. But all this craziness is uh, for a good cause. For science. More importantly, my wallet. I'm sacrificing my beauty sleep for you guys, so make sure you subscribe to see more content like this. Oh, and by the way, the money I earned during this mining event is probably going to be used to fund a hundred more nucleus runs, but I think I might do them a little differently next time. If this video hits, I don't know, maybe 500 likes, I'll do more nucleus runs. I'll even show the collection process on stream, so make sure you like the video if you want me to stream some collections for nucleus runs all right so around four and a half hours in the instance expired so it kicked me out of the lobby i don't have any footage of this so please just trust me since i figured that it'd be too much of a hassle to dig out a route again i just continued with the event through mithril mining since it is so accessible but to my mistake it took me like five to ten minutes to find the lobby where no one else was mining in the spots that i had in mind so yeah i kind of wasted a lot of time but it's whatever this wasn't really meant to be a sweaty experiment anyways okay so i started mithril mining because i accidentally pressed exit on the lobby that i was already in for gemstone mining and honestly i don't have enough time to set up another lobby before the fiesta ends so i'm just gonna go mithril mining it took me a while to also find a lobby without anyone in this spot but um, we'll see all right um the mining fiesta is about to end in about 10 seconds and uh, i think this one was pretty all right obviously i was more laid back with this one I didn't really try hard that much and i'm a little bit stupid so yeah, here, there we go. So, we'll see how much I have after everything. Okay, so it's been six hours later, eight hours, I think. I was really exhausted, so I, I slept. And uh, my overall money is now 1.3 billion. I started with 1.07 billion, now it's 1.3, so. It's over 200 million coins in one mining fiesta. That's pretty good considering how chill I was with it. So all in all, I made more than 200 million coins in five hours. I'm pretty sure I could have made more if I wasn't so tired and if I wasn't such an idiot, but 200 mil is 200 mil. How much did you guys make? Tell me down in the comments below and subscribe if you guys want more videos like these. And for a nucleus next video.